As you all know, I play a PvP locked hard crime and meaning I spend almost all my time in PvP worlds. And in PvP worlds, the weirdest shit is happening all the time. So here I am with another adventure video where you can see all these different kind of things you normally don't see. Hope you guys enjoy. Whenever I'm playing my PvP locked hard crime and I have a very strict rule to not attack any hunters uh, because I don't want to take advantage of the fact that they are hunting me. But in this scenario I hadn't been online for over one hour and they were just mining this shooting star because I was mining the shooting star. So I decided to log in under one of them and try to take them out. <laughs> I was mining and he just came and took my rock. How much did we make from that? 16.6 mil. Uh, I'm leaving like wizard boots on the ground. No! <laughs> what just happened? No way that just. <laughs> Everything in the bag, look at that! 4 mil from that! Sometimes in PvP worlds you find skillers who like to tick manipulate using an alt to hit them uh, which will allow them to gain more experience per hour but something they don't know is that if you hit 10 zeros in a row you can PJ them off He must be dead here oh. There we go, he's dead He could have went to the bank He must have so much darts <laughs> 13k bronze darts all right, I mean, I'm, I'm taking it. 315k in bronze darts. There are two peaking spots I've learned to love the last couple of months. The first one being outside of Ferox Enclave on the last man standing world. A lot of peakers are usually here and I've joined in on the fun. Oh my god, I actually did that. Oh my god, I got him. Oh my god, that's a lot of loot. I was lagging as well. How much is that? 9.8 mil. Why is he not dead? And he's dead. Normally when you see these guys outside of Ferrex Enclave, don't attack them because they got a clan behind them. But because I know how PvP mechanics works, I wasn't afraid. And he's dead. And there his guy comes. That's how they work. They bait people to come out and then we kill one of them and they, they get nothing. 1.8 mil, thank you. The second spot I've learned to enjoy, well, I've always enjoyed this spot, the dual arena, DH bombing the campers. High risk, high reward. Watch. Watch me whip, whip, watch me name. No way he survived. We got him. We got him with the DH, beautiful. Woo, 851k. Oh, he got me. <laughs> oh my god, he died to a poison. Free dragon axe. Let's go. Free Dragon Axe! Thank you very much! Why are you in a PvP world? And he's dead. Good fight. Like nothing. But it's... that's weird to find someone here. So we scouted this guy in decent risk killing Koras on a PvP world. So we lost aggro and went for him.
Alright, that was easy. Oh, there's coins. I see coins. 5k law runes, 5k nature runes, 11k. Alright, coins here. Coins? Ah, oh, sad. 360k. Uh, almost 5 mil. <laughs> he's, this man says he's testing his iPad. <laughs> Is that? He's... <laughs> he actually... Oh my god. I need to remove that item indicator thing. 1.5 mil, thank you. I normally don't give stuff back, but he was very friendly and he was on his iPad, so I gave most of it back. Good fight, sir. Easy 420k, thank you. He's so AFK right now. Oh, I'm so lucky as I am too. He could be risking something. Region bracelet, look at that. Sarah sword. I was not even looking for him. I was looking for a PvP locked hard crime. And there we go. 2.6 mil. Thank you. I'll take that. Speaking of PvP locked hard crime, there are only a handful PvP hard crime left. Less than 10, I would say. And the current rank 1 PvP locked hard crime is Finn's PvP hard crime. 700 mil bounty and private on. And I splashed the tail block. Great. We scouted this man training hunter at the Black Sallies in the wilderness. He's got 78 Hunter and apparently a PvP locked hard cry man, potentially going for Dragon Implings. So we did our best and went for him. <laughs> PvP hard cry man time! 70 Agility, 79 Hunter. Oh my god. <gasps> Tom Harder! He's here! He's actually here! Alright, here comes the Debo. No, he's still alive. All right, you check a Debo. Just check a Debo. Ah, oh, no. <laughs> Great tank from Thumb Harder. One of the few PvP hardcore men active. He survives another day. What was that? Look at this bronze uh, G. One melt. Mm, this guy is trying to trade lure me out. And he's dead. Dude, one mil PK from the guy who tried to trade lure me. Alright. We got a kill. How much is this? Five mil? Thank you. And he was just waiting outside. I don't know what he was doing. No, I'm peeking. Oh, smited. I'm at rev caves right now. Dead? Oh my god, a 75 to the head. Sad, he says. As I take all his loot. So, so normally I don't PK around here, but wilderness is so dead right now. And that's 550k. Thank you. At this point, I'd been in the rev caves for around 30 minutes and a max main together with his clan got on me. Wait, there's another guy coming. No, there's so many of them. I'm crumbling. He, he bullied his friend. For some reason, every time I'm being focused by a clan, I crumble and I mess everything up. And with the rev caves mechanics, you need to be tick perfect on the freeze and log out to even escape. And since I'm crumbling, I couldn't do that. It's over. <laughs> Oh, I'm dead. Gondrilla. What did I even lose here? All right, we got a stake 30 mil. If I win this, it's like I never died. Spoilers, I lost. So if I win this stake, it's almost as if I've never died and I never lost that first stake. 2020, 23. Oh my God. Use your spec. Easy. Easy win. We never died. We Let's never go, lost a dude. stake. It's like you just beat everyone in the clan in your own way. 
So I scouted this guy outside of safe zone at the farming skill. I thought he was an anti-peaker. There's a lot of anti-peaker here. Uh, but I decided to go for him anyway. What? It's like no HP left. Nah, this guy. What? Wait, what? 960k. He forgot he was in a PvP world. Makes sense. What the fuck? What the fuck? What the fuck? He must die here. Dead. Good fight. He said seriously, probably not risking anything, but could be a farmer. He was a farmer. Could have been GP, but no GP today. We're gonna end today's adventure video with this clip right here. I spotted two high risk fighters, one with around 50 mil risk and one with a rapier, over 100 mil risk in a high risk world. So my plan was simple, as they're going out, I'm gonna TB one of them and I went for the guy in rapier because he had more risk. We got a TB. Oh my god! Was that a bait all the time? Was that a bait all the time? Honestly, I had no clue they were waiting for me there. They were risking over 100 mil just to catch me in my 20 mil risk. Good attempt, good attempt. And with that being said, I am very close to 250,000 subscribers, which is my goal this year. So if you want to help me reach my goal, leave a subscription down below and maybe even a thumbs up. And I'll see you guys very, very soon.